Today we have ourselves a Scream 4 mask unboxing, so uh, let's get spooky. <laughs> Greetings everyone, my name is Nightshade, this is the Night Shift, a home for all things spooky, and today we have a Scream 4 Ghostface mask unboxing. More like unpacking, uh, th this isn't a box at all. We also have the opportunity to make things right. So what is in this package is the Scream 4 reshoot mask, the TD uh, Ghostface style mask. Now we have unboxed one of these on the channel before, but uh, a handful of you guys corrected me. So even though this is the correct shape and mold of the mask, it is not the same style mask used in the reshoots of Scream 4 because my mask does not glow in the dark. However, in this package, we have a TD reshoot mask that does in fact glow in the dark. So it is the proper mask used in Scream 4. I saw it pop up on eBay and the price was even better than I got for this one. So had to pull the trigger. I mean, it was a must and I'm super pumped about this mask. So let's go ahead and get into the package. I'm hoping that this is in okay shape because I'm not a huge fan that it was uh, shipped in an envelope, but uh, we'll, we'll see. And here we have it. This is the glow in the dark TD stamp ghost face mask. And uh, yeah, it's actually in really good condition. So it didn't show up on camera, but I did confirm that this does in fact glow in the dark and it glows pretty bright. Really happy with the overall look of this mask, the overall shape. The, the reshoot ghost face mask has always been one of my favorites just because it is uh, pretty different from your standard ghost face mask like the the shape of the mouth is different like these are more narrow than the traditional eu ghost face masks the noses on these are also way sharper than the noses on the eu um i know it like probably on camera it doesn't make much of a difference but uh you know it's one of those things where if you're in the mask collecting hobby you can start to pick out the little differences in all of these masks but yeah i'm super happy with this copy i love the way that it looks um it's also the vinyl is a lot thinner than um uh, my my non-glow td ghost face mask like this one is a lot firmer and a lot harder feeling whereas this one feels a lot more loosey-goosey loosey-goosey so what i'm going to do right now is i'm going to put this on a head and get you guys some uh close-up shots of the mask and then we will meet back here and end the video all right see you guys there And there we have it. Uh, super, super happy with this mask. I love the TD style masks. I think they look really cool. And because I don't need two of these in my collection, um, I'm actually gonna gift the non-glow mask to one of my friends in the hobby. You know, I've got a lot of masks right now that just don't really have a place anywhere. So, I mean, I need to start downsizing a little bit. I'm running out of room. So this one will be going to one of my friends and uh, this one will be staying in the ghost face collection in the back behind me here. And that's just going to about do it for me. Uh, we are going to continue doing the movie review starting next week. We're doing Thanksgiving and also doing uh, Black Friday next week. So uh, be on the lookout for those. I've actually never seen Thanksgiving. I'm going to be checking it out this week and uh, super pumped to check it out as well. Oh, if you like the video, let me know by leaving me a like comment down below what you want to see on the channel next i will do my best to accommodate and until next time my name is nightshade this has been the night shift and i will see you in the next video stay spooky my friends <laughs>